talking about insects and pollinators and all these cool things from things that are so tiny they can make such a big impact on who we are and what we do now take a look what do you see around miss miranda today can you think of a community whose members all have special jobs yes ants they're kind of like bees some members are soldiers and they defend their home against enemies others are nurses and they take care of the babies still more gather food or build new places to live this is what talk what ants do boys and girls they have even though we might see only the little tiny opening underneath is their big family community yes ants are great at working together are you good at working together are you a good problem solver they talk to each other just like bees do they tap their antenna they tap their two antennas or their feelers and if one ant discovers food boys and girls it will hurry off to find its friends leaving a scent or a trail along the way the other ants follow the trail and help carry the food back to the ant hill so look we have pet thorax abdomen abdomen pet thorax abdomen abdomen they have six legs antenna two head thorax abdomen abdomen now ants also have mandibles they're like little pinchers here on the front see those two mandibles yeah that helps them get their food and carry it they have their legs their head, their thorax, their abdomen, and their antenna. These antennas are so important for the life of an ant. That's right. Now, remember their ant hill here. Even though we only see the tippity top, underneath is a beautiful community or family for the ants. Now, ants lay eggs. The eggs turn into a larva, which looks like a little tiny worm. The larva becomes a pupa or a baby ant. And then because they're taken such good care of, they'll turn into an adult or a big ant. So ants, just like bees and plants, have a life cycle where they start as an egg and follow the cycle all the way around to the big grown-up ant. That's right, boys and girls. Ants are important. They work together. They live together. They communicate together. Have you ever seen an ant hill? Miss Miranda has an ant farm here. I'm just waiting for our ants to come. Once our ants come, We'll put them in and we can watch them start to tunnel and dig. Ants eat lots of different things. Ants drink water. Ants are just like us. They need to be healthy to survive. Ants, just like us, they're good problem solvers. And just like us, they live in their big family, boys and girls. So what you're going to do now is you're going to find your life cycle of your ant. You're going to color it. You're going to cut and you're going to glue. Thanks, and I'll see you soon.